What's up guys? How you doing? John here from Titan and I want to talk to you today about vitamin D. Vitamin D is a very, very important part of our body as far as taking care of our system on the inside. So vitamin D isn't really a vitamin. Vitamin D is really a hormone and vitamin D is produced in the kidneys. And why is it produced in the kidneys? It's produced in the kidneys to control calcium concentration blood levels. And at that point, that directly impacts the immune system. So vitamin D is very, very important because if you don't have the right amount of vitamin D or you're vitamin D deficient, there's a lot of negative things that can impact your health. Now, talk about osteoporosis, right? Like rickets and stuff like that. That's what kids were getting with, with deficient vitamin D levels. Uh, muscle soreness, hair loss, uh, cause kidney problems. There's a lot of issues that go along with vitamin D deficiency. And it's a big, big thing. And it's very easy to take care of. You can honestly just get a blood test, see if you're deficient. And if you are deficient, you can try an oral supplement. If that oral supplement doesn't work on the next blood test, there is an vitamin D injectable you can take once a week. We do offer it here at Titan, but I'm sure another general practitioner or something like that can help you as well. And this is very, very important because it's usually not tested for. So, next time you go to your doctor or you come to Titan, you can always ask for a vitamin D test. If you're feeling lethargic, this could be another side effect from vitamin D deficiency. So it's really, really something to look into. Now, how do you raise your vitamin D levels without taking an injection or an oral supplement? Well, they say that diet is one of the biggest things you can do. So, look into your diet, make sure you can change some things, you can research these things and what to eat, right? That's one thing. They say number two is from sunlight. Now, if you live in a sunlight state, like sunny Florida, that I live in, right? You would think that me going outside all the time or going to these events outside where I get plenty of sunlight, way more than 15 minutes, that my body would be able to convert it and I would be, you know, vitamin D, uh, you know, uh, not deficient, but I would absorb a lot more vitamin D. So at that point, what happens is, is our body doesn't convert it, so that's why it's important to test for it. At that point, when you have your vitamin D levels and they get to the right level or above and they aren't deficient, I promise you, you will be feeling better. Me, myself, we're, I am vitamin D deficient, so I have to take an injection. Sharice is vitamin D deficient, and a lot of our patients find out they are vitamin D deficient, no matter what state or how much sunlight they're getting. Now, their diets can be really, really good, but we've seen people be vitamin D deficient that are super, super strict on their diets as well. So it's just always something to look for that can benefit your health in a major, major way. Vitamin D can be toxic to your system. If you take too much vitamin D in, it can hurt you. So don't do that. Make sure you blood test and know where you're at. Vitamin B12 is water-based and it can excrete through your body, where vitamin D is a hormone and will not excrete out through your urine and through your body. So be sure you are safe in taking vitamin D. It's not something to take in an abundance, but something to make sure that you're in the right ranges for. So that's the spiel about vitamin D. I'm John from Titan. If you like these videos, please check out our YouTube. There's plenty of educational videos on there, instructional videos on how to do the injections, what we do at Titan, and more. Also, check out our social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Snapchat, guys. I'm John from Titan. Give us a call or text if you want more information. 727-389-3220. Check out TitanMedicalCenter.com.